All right, guys. So we've got a uh, 2016 F-150 with the EcoBoost 2.7. It's a twin turbo little V6, and he's got a code. He's got a wastegate code. Now he didn't drive the vehicle for, I think he said 12 days. When he did, he got a check engine light. Seemed like he didn't have the power that it had after he drove it for a little while. The light did go out. Um, but, but what the code was was a P1016. In fact, let's go ahead and get into this and let's see if it's still got the code set, which it probably will. It's the USA Ford. And we're going to see if we can control the wastegate with this. The vehicle's got about 155,000 miles. Uh, and more than likely since it's set for so long the wastegate probably just stuck and then once he drove it and everything warmed up it probably started working again but we're going to see if we can uh, first let's read the code see if it's still uh, still there and my guess is that the wastegate's just getting sticky and since you know since it set it stuck when he drove it it opened up okay there's the P2 uh, or 1016 Control pressure of wastegate is higher than expected. So let's go ahead and back out of that. We'll go into the actuation test. <clears throat> this is the Xtool D8BT, by the way. Okay, so there's the wastegate. Okay. Let me get the camera set up to where you'll be able to see this and we'll see if the if this tool will control the waste gate. Okay, so I got the scan tool sitting right here so that I can reach it. The waste gate. Now this has got two waste gates on it because it's twin turbo. Um let me see, what am I looking at here? Okay. Okay, see that linkage? That's the waste gate. Uh, so I'm gonna now it's vacuum operated, so I've got to have the engine running, and we're gonna see if we can control it. So let me start this engine up. I've got the scan tool. Let me go ahead and click waste gate. We're on the screen we need to be on. And we'll see if the if the D8 a lot of question a lot of people question whether or not the scan tool can actually control you know items J just because it's got a button and I do these you know I do a lot of walkthroughs uh, a lot of people question whether the scan tool is actually capable of doing it so let's let's find out okay so there's the linkage okay I'm going to start tapping the button Okay, let's open it. That was closing. And there you have it. Now, that does tell me that the wastegate's working. It can be controlled by the computer. So what you're doing whenever you tell the scan tool to open and close whether it's the wastegate or anything else, is you're telling the scan tool is actually telling the computer to open or close or actuate whatever the item is. So the computer is able to uh, control the wastegate. Anyway, I'll tell you what. Let's let's take a look at the other side. See if we can see the uh, see if we can find the wastegate over here. Okay, you can barely see it from this thing. Let me see if I can zoom in past all this stuff. I think that's it right there. So let me get the skin tool here. Get it blurred out of the different. Hold on.
Ready? There you go. You can see that move. I'm just tapping the button on the uh, go the other way. Just tapping the buttons down here, the plus and minus. Right now we're at zero percent. Anyway, that's the uh, this is a 2016 F-150 with the uh, 2 liter, 2.7 liter EcoBoost twin turbo engine the uh, D8 X-Tool is able to control the uh, the, the uh, wastegate so anyway that's it for this video you guys take care, we'll see you in the next one